What's up, everybody? And Eric here with some um, redstone. As you can obviously tell, back there, I kind of built something. Um, I did this all off camera because the redstone we're doing today is kind of huge. It's pretty big. So I did all this off camera, as you can see. Um, we're going to build some sort of um, mini game around zombies killing a villager. Um, it's kind of, you know, you know, the game, Plants vs. Zombies, Blue Tide of Defense. It's kind of like that. You get to summon, you know, little helper things. You get a bow and everything. Also, I made a, and this is similar to my other mini game like this one, except it was way bigger and that was the problem. It was kind of too big. But this is also a little restaurant I got done beforehand. This looks pretty cool. Watch this. Boom. I'm upstairs. So, <laughs> now I'm playing. So today we're gonna get um, done with that. We're gonna have buttons, and I'm gonna get some signs and everything. We're gonna, you know, get done with that. So let's just hop into it. I don't have much time. Okay. So what we need first are probably buttons and signs. Just get some buttons. Um, where am I gonna put the buttons though? I don't have much room. I should have made like an area to start rounds and summon stuff. Actually, I'm gonna do that. Let's let's just do that real quick. Um. I'll just like do it outside the arena. Um, it's not gonna be a box or anything, it's just gonna be a wall. So let's get speed two. Um, just passed it. And we're going to drink this. Okay, drinkable speed two is like way better than regular just speed two. So we're gonna make a long line here. And I think I might have some sticky pistons thrusting you forward so you can just get there and get out pretty fast. Um, so yeah, so we're going to make a long line here um, and we're going to have buttons. This isn't going to be too fancy, it's just going to be, I'm not going to have any walls or anything, it's just going to be, you know, um, a thing that I built just so I can save some room in there. Um, we're going to have like just some walls, just, just some basic walling. Um, here, not nothing, no, no roof or anything, just some basic walling. So it's just, you know, so we can have buttons and signs. Okay, let's just now get this done. Okay, so here we go. Now, I'm going to have some of them be manual, like you're going to have, you can place these little little shooter, shooters um, wherever you please. Actually, I don't think I can do that now since this is a circular form instead of a straight form. I'm going to have everything like already placed, but in order to actually use it, you have to pay for it or something. And I'm going to have producers that have that um, you can use and everything. It's, it, I'm going to do producer and stuff um, and all that stuff kind of later. Off cam, but right now uh, we're just gonna focus on kind of spawning the zombies and rounds. Um, I'll have another area, and this is where all the all the um, extra helpers are gonna be and everything. This area over here, that's gonna be a lot. But you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get I'm, all I'm gonna do is worry about the roundage. So well, let's just grab a sign because that's what that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to do roundage. I've done this before um, on a past video. If you wanna check that out. Um, I'm not going to put a link in the description because, oh my god, no, please don't. If, um, I encourage you to go check it out, but be aware, this was, this was when I kind of, this was before I really got into, I actually, I've never really got, this was before, um, I tinkered with this stuff a little bit, I actually tinkered with this, um, a little bit off camera and everything. Um, this was be and the first time I did it, I never really tinkered with it, so it was just me messing up a million times. So if you want to check that out, and you know, just go through one of my videos on Redstone playlist, and you know, I have it there. Um, but you know, if you actually want to get, if you actually want to learn something, I do not recommend you going to look for that. But if you want to just see me fail me all the times, yeah, you know, that's also you know a decision. Um, also. I just want to say, um, I like to, you know, accommodate, I like to spend a whole minute on here just accommodating this, this specific roofing. I think that looks really good. Um, just spent like a minute on that. Um, so back to this. What I'm going to do is probably have, 
I'm going to start off with five rounds on camera, and then I'm going to do the rest off camera. And then I'll probably get a bunch of friends to do to play the game. It's You can have, and then I'll have like a laneage. Like, that's what I didn't do on one of my videos. I'm going to have how many lanes you can want. You have specific amount of lanes. You can do all four, or you can do one, or you can do two. I think that's what I'll do, and I'll do that inside the walls, and that won't be too hard. Five round. Let's go back to your Okay. Um, so, today's the weekend, guys. You know, that's good. Right? I'm sorry, commentary was slacking because Matthew's not here. <laughs> um, but, you know, today's the weekend, um, which is... You know, just I'm just going to do this. I should have done this off camera. That would have been way better. You know what? Here we go. I'll do the rest of it off camera, but we're gonna, I'm just going to show you what's basically going on here. Um, what's basically going on, I'm going to have zombies spawning in. I'll just get rid of all that. Zombies spawning in. did that on accident. Gonna, okay. Focus. Focusing hat. We're going to have zombies spawning in round after round, and each round has a certain amount of zombies. I think round one will start with two, three zombies. Round two, you know, get more and more and more until eventually you're at round ten and then there's an endless zone which I always add in which will form, which will make all the lanes form no matter what you do and no matter what button you press will form, rejoin all the lanes and then it will spawn all the zombies like at a certain at a couple seconds and it'll slowly get faster and faster until like you're spawning until they're, the spawner's out of, and you know, zombies and you win the game. Now, um, during this, you can go over here, which will, which is, there's nothing there yet, but, you know, there'll be an area over there where you can buy stuff, like, um, TNT cans, which are probably need to turn the stone, not TNT cans, no, uh, you know, dispenser shoots arrow, flaming air, flaming stuff, you know, um, I was initially gonna do TNT, TNT cans, but, you know, all this stuff might blow up, and I don't want that to happen, um, but, yeah, I think this will be pretty cool. Let's start with round one. Actually, so let's get, you know, stuff that we'll need. I think this is all we'll need. Um, it goes, you know, it's actually not that hard. It's a simple, actually I'll need a piston of any kind, you know, piston. There you go. Um, and I also need some wool. Um, so it's not that hard actually, um, to make one of these. It's quite simple. If you know the basic redstone current, it's like, it's basically that. And then I have a thing that stops the current, a thingy. I call it a thingy. It's like a dinghy, except with a T instead of a D. Um, a little thingy that stops it. So let's just, you know, just build. Let's just build all around here. I should probably light this place up. Um, just grab some torches. I'm not gonna. Actually, it would be smarter for me to just do uh, I'm an idiot. Just, just write that in the comments. Eric's an idiot. Just put that there. I'm pretty sure a lot of you have already put that, but you know what? Just, you know, put that again. Okay, so let's just go around. And let's just do that. And then we're going to have a circle. I'll do that later. Right now, I would like to show you this. Okay, so we're going to have round one, say, spawn, I don't know, three zombies. We'll start off with three. So we're going to have a little base, a basic redstone current, a basic, a very basic redstone current here. You know, we're going to have this go for, you know, enough time. So it's two, three, four. Okay, now here's the other part that you need to know. This is crucial. So this will spawn a zombie every four seconds, since each redstone repeater adds a second. So you just have repeater over here, so one, two, three, four, that spawns in a zombie. One, two, three, four, spawns in another zombie. Because it every every four seconds, it will spawn in a, the, the current will spawn in another zombie. So that's eight seconds, so I'll spawn in two, and then three, four. We'll spawn in three zombies. Now, we're going to go back to the redstone current. It's going to go back to the redstone current. We're going to put a piston down, and it will break the current and stop zombies from spawning for the rest of the round until you click 
another button which activates another current and it basically does the same thing over and over again each one adding more repeaters to make more zombie spawn that's basically the entire concept um, it's not that hard to build it's just annoyingly long and just ridiculous amount of redstone um, you know you have to build on creative obviously to get zombie spawns or you can be lucky enough to build this underground and have a zombie spa mob spawner and just rearrange it to where you can um, you know obviously build zombies around it uh, have the stuff work like this like you know it opens the door for a couple seconds let zombies in and you know stuff like that but somebody has to be standing beside it which sucks and you know it's it, it causes problems I'm sorry just, let's get back to the stuff that we do know and not the stuff that people are asking why are you talking about okay so let's get back um, to this um, the reason I add repeaters is just to make sure the current stays you know strong it's better to have more too many repeaters than not enough okay so let's just break this down. Okay. okay so we're just gonna have this go around oh I had the repeaters go the wrong way my bad I'm pretty sure somebody was yelling at me for that Okay, so let's just see. We're already 11 minutes in, and I didn't even do anything. Okay, yeah. And I already checked everything. This is exactly how... No, okay. Really, real, 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 real quick. Um, this is the exact size you need it to be. This is the max size you can have it to be, because uh, a zombie will only see a villager 17 blocks away. You can make the edges around here a little bit wider into a more circle shape, but... This is exact. This is the exact size it needs to be. If you can make it, if you want it smaller, you can, have, you can make it smaller. But any bigger than this, um, it's kind of stupid, and it wouldn't work. But you know, 17 blocks is the max. Um, how far is the max? Maximum far, and you have to kind of build it in the two by two area like this. Um, I'll make um if I can. I don't think I can, but I'll try to do, um, I don't think, actually, I can't do that. Um, I'll go into great detail, maybe, I'll do another episode of this, and probably go into great detail next time. Okay. 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 This is where it's going. Oh, yeah, we want it to go this way, and not that way. Okay, yeah. Okay, so we're going to go this way. Okay. We're going to make it go this way. We're just going to have it go around like this. As you can see, um, there's me testing out something. Um, I was wondering if I could move. Um, oh, little known fact. You cannot move chests with a sticky piston. I did not know that, honestly. Um, until I tested it out. Because that would be awesome. Like, you know, so you can have... Um, more so you can move the chest to have more stuff holding it or you know move it to different hoppers um, if you click a button or something I think that'd be really cool for mini games also I plan on doing playing um, I also plan on playing uh, getting back into you know gaming other gaming random gaming um, hopefully I'll do that soon uh, I never got any view many views from it but you know I might I'm not gonna, I might not do as much DC because I never got really much views from it, but I did get a lot of views from other stuff. Um, not a lot of views, but I'm I only did DC, and I th I'm gonna get back into random gaming. Um, also, so here this is how it will work. Here, let me just uh, okay. Let me get rid of the villager. Actually, you know what? The villager can die. You know what? You'll forget you build. Okay, so let me just show you how it work. Click the button. This starts round one. Okay, so as it, as you can. Oh dang it! I